got a big buck on film. It's the buck I've been hunting. You double that! Nice shot! Oh, got him! Dude. Yeah! That a boy. <laughs> We've just pulled into this property. And as we're coming in on the gravel road, <laughs> our turkeys, and I don't know if any of them are a tom, but we're on the bottom side of a little hill here, and about 30 yards away from me is the top of this berm and a field. And those birds are sitting right there, so this might be a quick hunt. Let's just go see what happens here, okay? See him? They're still there. He's standing out. He's coming this way. You see him? He's running at you, Sam. Get ready. Let him have it. <laughs> Dude, that just happened? That just happened. This is happening. Have you ever seen anything like this? No. I mean, I'm standing in the wide open talking to you. They're 20 yards away. They feel like I'm watching TV right now, but I'm actually in it. Should I walk up to him? See how close he can get. Sam is less than about probably 10 yards from these birds right now. That bird is freaking out.
That was insane. What just happened? That was insane. I've never... <clears throat> I'm not sure if I've ever... I don't even know what to say. I can't put words together. That's so weird. In the coolest way possible. We put on a reap and then less than a minute or two. Done. Done. This is awesome. Like... Hey man, give me some. <laughs> cool. That right. was insane. I think you're gonna be home in time. You said you had to be home by noon? By noon. <laughs> Alright, well... <laughs> yeah, we're okay. I guess we'll just throw it in the truck and then go home. Yeah, no sh**. Man, oh man. Holy cow. What a great bird. Big old Tom. I mean, this that's... is some cool lighting too. <coughs> Special thanks to Ryan Booth for uh, getting me permission to come out to this farm again. You, sir, I owe you a venison dinner and I guess uh, some turkey jerky because, <laughs> man, uh, two and a half trips out here. The other half is another story for another day. And uh, I've got a nice big wide buck off this property in 25 minutes and now the two minute hunt for the big tom turkey so uh thanks brother dave and i are just sitting here we're watching the footage over in the truck and uh, i noticed that my feet are just continuously getting wet and so i look down and i'm reminded that the boots i'm wearing <laughs> spent two seasons in the backyard by the wood pile you can see they're they're coming unglued a little bit <laughs> i think they're literally falling apart as i'm wearing them like the soles are falling off as I'm walking. I'm almost glad that our our, uh, our hunt was done in two minutes because um, I think if we had had a hunt anymore today, the soles would have fallen right off and I'd have been <laughs> yeah, up shit creek without a paddle. I don't know why I decided to wear them today. They were just the quickest ones I could find in the garage and I thought Lucky about boots. I thought about throwing them away but it had rained on them so many times they looked clean. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, I'll just put those on. As long as there's no spiders in them, I didn't know they were gonna fall apart. <laughs>